things were good while they lasted. But Quebec's health minister is back to being the bearer of bad news. I confirm that for the moment, a first case of the new variant has been confirmed in Quebec. By Wednesday, the daily COVID count in Quebec surpassed 1,200 cases, the highest they've been since April. The vaccine rollout for kids aged 5 to 11 is underway. But in the meantime, Dubé says cases are going up in schools. International travel also cause for concern. We can see that the variant is starting to spread all over the world. So no matter where you travel, you must be careful. This week, the feds confirmed Canada's first case of the Omicron variant came through the Montreal airport. Another came through Ottawa. While the Delta variant is still dominant in Quebec, the Cree Health Board says their eyes are on Ottawa. And this week reported one travel-related case in UHT. With their first COVID-related death not far in the rear view, the northern Quebec region of Nunavik is reporting a total of 62 cases. Communities in central Quebec, like Wamotishi, are seeing small COVID clusters tied to schools. Council is pressing parents to vaccinate their kids and report their symptoms ASAP. Si la personne a des symptômes puis elle attend une semaine puis elle a la COVID, mais a beaucoup plus de risques de propager l'infection dans la communauté. But the risk remains highest to the south, like in Gunnawage Mohawk Territory, reporting 29 active cases and 70 community members in isolation. Kids there can line up for their shots as of this weekend, but public safety still considers it a red alert situation. We're all here you know, trying to uh, minimize this. Uh, we don't want to overreact, but we don't want to underreact as well, because uh, we, we want to get a handle on where things are going. Um, everybody wants to have a, a safe you know, holiday season. Everybody wants to enjoy the holiday season, you know, especially our children. Quebec's public health ministry says the next two weeks are critical. And without improvement, they'll likely be doubling down on preventative measures again in time for the holidays in hopes of lowering the daily case count. In the meantime, they're pressing for booster shots and vaccination of the 5 to 11 age group whenever and wherever those vaccines are available. Lindsay Richardson, APTN National News, Montreal.